<laughs> what a deck! Hello and welcome to What a Deck, where we play troll decks, rogue decks, and whatever the hell I feel like. I'm Hardleg Joe, and today we're looking at the Gladiator Beast Beatbox. It's uh, part beatdown, part toolbox. Uh, should be interesting. Infected male is here. <laughs> uh, anyway, if you just want the deck list, there's a uh, link in the description that'll take you to the profile. I'll just explain what's in here and what its role is in the deck. Otherwise, I'm going to be playing ten duels against random opponents and having a fun time doing it. And we're going to see how this sucker does. I just say sucker. I don't normally say sucker. Whatever. <laughs> All right, here we are. First duel versus Streeter. We are, of course, uh, Maximus. I, of course, have to turn down the volume. Why wouldn't I? And we've got our very nice uh, Gladiator Beast sleeves. It's got a whole bunch of Gladiator Beasts on it. I'm really happy the way they came out. I think they look pretty nice. And, uh, of course, I've got to recommend that, uh, or not recommend, but I should tell you, if you want uh, these sleeves, I give all the sleeves away on my Patreon to anyone who donates a dollar or more. So, there you go. Looks like we're playing against Trap Tricks, some sort of hyper-efficient Trap Tricks. Should be interesting. He got uh, Trap Tricks Trap Hole Nightmare. Why can I not... Eh. Oh, okay. That didn't work. Show me what this card does. Fine. I forget what Trap Tricks Trap Hole Nightmare does. I may be in for a spot of bother because I got a lot of monsters with over 1800 attack. Um, but let's see, maybe I won't get bottom list. And then I can get rid of this. Huh? Ooh. You got it. Oh, there's the bottom list. Eh. I'll go ahead and not set Wabaku because I'm pretty sure that he can't OTK me. And I don't want him to be destroying that. I kind of need that for, for future endeavors. If you're unfamiliar with the Gladiator Beast, which I don't know how you couldn't be, uh, they're, they're one of the oldest decks, not the oldest decks, but they're one of the, they're one of those decks that's like still good years after they come out. Not like top tier by any means, but they're kind of like grave keepers and that they, they still keep competitive. Like if you wanted to invest in a deck that would be good probably a year from now, or be as good as it is now, a year from now, I would recommend Gladiator Beast. Okie dokie. Let's try this again. He's only got the one bottomless. We'll just get our other, uh, Lacquery. Liquari. I don't know, they got all these, uh, Roman, Roman sounding names. I took some Latin, but I don't know all these. So let's get rid of this, because that makes me think you have some kind of Dino Rabbit. And let's not trade out yet, because we got more attack. I don't want him to destroy this other one. Plus now these are useful. Plus I'm, if I remember correctly, um, Trap Tricks Trap Hole Nightmare is when a special summoned monster activates its effect. So if I summon something, he would just instantly like blow it up. Um, as long as this is normal summoned, it's immune to quite a few things. I mean, he could make Castell and send it back here. Oh no, he's gonna go for that Ragna Zero. Interesting. Well, that'll give him an extra card. That sucks. That kinda sucks. Um... Yeah, and we're just gonna take the damage. Because again, these are useful for making plays. Yeah, that's what I was saying. So the Gladiator Beast, uh, they all have the same effect. Um, that if they attack or are attacked at the uh, end of the battle phase, you can tag them back into the deck and special summon another Gladiator Beast with a different name from your deck. And they all have effects that, like, when they're summoned by the effect of a Gladiator Beast, they have some kind of effect. Um, this guy goes up to 2100 base attack. This guy can summon another one. This one can grab a Gladiator Beast from your graveyard. Um... Let's see. So, we're gonna try this guy. Because he is not a beast warrior, so Tenki will not be affecting him. Well, you got. You know, you solemn warning on this thing. Just do massive damage. Well, we've got our infected male. 
It's an interesting card, not often used. Um, once per turn, target a level 4 lower monster you control. It can attack your opponent directly this turn, but send it to the graveyard at the end of the battle phase. Luckily for us, this monster will not be here at the end of the battle phase. What we're going to do is give him the old attack directly. Bada bingo. And then at the end of that phase, special summon. And we're just going to kill his monster. With Mermillo, when he's summoned, destroy one monster on the field. Now he might trap tricks, trap hole, nightmare that. Depends if he has other monsters. Seems like kind of a waste on this 800-400, but then again he'll have a clear field. Yep, there's the nightmare. Um, and there's not much I can do about that. Fortunately, I still have one more. Well, no, I can't use him because he'll be killed instantly with that. Kind of sucks. It's trap-heavy decks are the weakness of uh, Gladiator Beast. At least my build of it. I don't have a lot of, like, trap negation or back row. The only thing I have that takes care of back row is my, uh, Bestiari. Uh, where is it at? This, up. Oh. One second. Got a Wabaku on that one. This guy, this little green bird guy, when he's summoned, he destroys one uh, back row card. And you could fusion summon him into something even bigger. A good old contact fusion. Hey, he's not a beast warrior. So let's try this again, shall we? Granted, if he's got another trap tricks, trap hole nightmare, I'm going to be in for a spot of bother, because I can only use... This is essentially Wabaku, does the exact same thing. Your monsters can't be destroyed and you take no battle damage. Um, but you have to have a face-up gladiator beast to do it. So if he destroys this before it's his turn, um, I, can't, I can't do stuff. But these are really good. You let your opponent attack into you and then you activate them. And your monster's not destroyed. And since they got attacked, they can then use their effects. So you can surprise them on their turn with your Mermillos or your Bestiaris. He is waiting. We will be back. Okay, finally, stopped waiting. We're just going to go ahead and infected mail. And we're going to try the exact same play again, because we need to get this guy off the field before we can use Darius. Oh, he's got a fiendish chain. That is a pity, because this will send it to the mail at the end of the battle phase. Um, hmm. If I don't go to the battle phase... There's only one way to find out. Yeah! Because I didn't go to the battle phase, he is not sent to the thing. So as long as you don't attack directly, you're good. Um, unfortunately, I'm not going to be able... Well, I can stop myself from taking damage, but he's just going to be destroyed. Or not, he won't be destroyed, but... Um, because I got these. But he's not going to be able to activate his effect, sadly. Really, my best hope now is if I can draw into a bestiary, I can make my synchro mont or my fusion monster and blow up his other back row. What are you doing? You can't. No, it's the whole turn. Stop attacking. Oh, can I? Ah, oh, damn it! I clicked the wrong button. I didn't think about that. Um. Oh yeah, that's a cost. Oh, I would be able to do that. Son of a bitch. I'm dumb. I was too confident. Now he's got a Logia or something. Yep. When a monster would be normal or special summon or a trap card activated. Detach to, negate, and destroy. Fuck. I should have done stuff there. I could have done stuff there, and I didn't. That's my bad. If I lose this, it is not because this deck sucks. It is because I suck. Future future duels, maybe not so much. We'll see. I'm I'm not this this deck has been really kind of a hit and miss in testing, like. I had some days where it did like it went undefeated for the first two days that I played it. Um and then today I had like a string of bad duels before this, like trying to get ready. Um So we'll we'll see. I hope it at least oh, that's nice. Um Yeah, let's try to dark hole. He'll negate that, my monster will still be here, and then maybe I can go for the Ixie play. Oh wait, no, why would I do that? 
Yeah, I got this. Oh, wait, no. If I summon this, he's dead. Fuck. Fuck shit, fuck. Um, but at least he... And he'll get another card, too. Damn fire formations. Um... Yeah, I mean, we've got another one of these, so let's just... Let's just try that again. Take two of what I was trying to do last time. At least he burnt this, so if I get something next turn, I can summon it. Hopefully this won't shuffle it into the deck and then give me nothing. I don't... Yeah, it has to be on the field for this to work. Oh, great, he's got rank three. This guy is just playing the, uh... The, uh... What was it? The Dino Rabbit deck from, like, a few years ago with some trap tricks thrown in. Kind of interesting. Oh, and I guess he's got some of those. Yeah, my, uh... Ugh, oh, I didn't realize that. My, uh, negation animation is actually... You don't have a banished monster. I guess that's just the only one he has? I don't know. Let's try that again. Yeah, my negated animation is the, uh, the guy from My Body is a Shield, which I ran three of originally. There we go. That's the way we wash our hands. Um, yeah, I need to get rid of that thing. Wakacha! Bitch, your Ragna Zero's gone! <laughs> okay. I think I got this now. So, this guy will have more attack than that. Let's attack over this. All dead. We'll summon out. We'll get our Bestiati in defense mode. Kill that, hopefully, unless he's got another Trap Tricks Trap Hole. No, he did not. So now, we just gotta hope that this is, uh, that he doesn't have another Trap Hole for us. He probably does, because he has a lot of Trap Holes. But if not, we may have just gotten enough advantage to win the game here. Because this guy, when he's summoned, you can blow up two cards on the field. Oh, Great Horn of Heaven. But I drew a card. So can he, oh, I don't think, well... Uh, it didn't look like he had a whole lot of summoning. Granted, if he gets, like, Rescue Rabbit or something. Tour Bus. Interesting. Now I'm going to be in for a spot of bother, but I won't have to use my Infected Mail. I can just attack with Darius. Attack with Darius, get my other Mermelo, get rid of that. And then I have my Draw Muscle, which I can target a monster with a thousand or less defense. Draw a card. And also, that target cannot be destroyed by battle this turn. Really good for your Mermellows and other other cards with less than a thousand. Ah! Fuck you! Fuck you, buddy! You and your fiendish chains! Ooh! I just gotta hope he summons another monster. Please summon another monster. Oh, he said it! That bastard. Yep, so we were close. We had a decent... Well, we weren't close, but we almost had a comeback. Just too trap-heavy. But we'll see if we can do a little better in the next duel. Okay, here we are, second duel versus Kakarot. Goku himself has come to challenge us to card games. Got a 42-card deck, I believe we saw there. Ooh, we're going first. That's never good. Um, let's just start off strong. Put out our highest attacker. Set that. Your go, good sir. Yeah, you always want to go second with this this deck because you want to attack. Um, got a card trooper, so maybe we're looking at light swarms. I wish I could look at his graveyard. I guess I'll have to wait. That's okay. Life is sweet, they cool, they the offbeats, not taking any damage, and that shuffles itself back into the deck. So we'll get that, we'll get out our Meyer Meyer, pants on fire, kill that guy, draw a Kyr, Kyrd, that is something. Okay, 
What do I got here? Okay, it's some kind of weird synchro -y deck. Uh, so come on, not Torrential Tribute. Fuck, it's waiting. Bottomless tarp hole. So we just get the 800. And we'll go ahead and tag out. Something with less than a thousand. Um... None of these are really useful at the moment. I'm going to go... I'm just going to go Bestiari, because even if he ends up in the graveyard, then we can set up for future plays. So we'll set that, and then we'll go. Now a lot of these are... A lot of people don't play uh, Demokery. Dima? I just call him Dima. Um, he's one of the lesser ones, but he works really, really good with Infected Mail. Um... Let's just go ahead and do that. Put the infected mail. We'll put it on a uh, bestiari, just because he has the higher attack. So we'll attack directly. But yeah, when he's summoned by a uh, gladiator beast effect, he can attack twice. So if you use him with infected mail, uh, you can get like thirty-two hundred in one turn. So he could destroy one of our things. I'm gonna get rid of the draw muscle. Let's tag out. We'll get our... We've just got draw muscle in the graveyard. Yeah, we'll get this guy to set up for next turn. And this guy will just get... Uh... Hmm. Yeah, nothing in the graveyard. Let's just get Lacquery. He has the most attack. Lakari. Then we'll get our War Chariot so we can negate an effect, so if he happens to get that good old, uh, you know, Michael or Judgment Dragon, we can get rid of that. Maybe stop his combos. Debris Dragon. Oh no. Um, that was his normal summon. Let's just stop him here. Hacha. That's really one of those things I keep going back and forth on. It's like, do you stop them early on and hope that they have no other way of recovering beyond their normal summon? Like, hope that he can't special summon stuff like that? <laughs> or do you wait for him to do all these things and then you go? So, we're going to be in for... I don't know why he put that out there. Especially against gladiator beasts. Because that's just going to mean that whatever I get can attack over that. Unless he plans the Synchro Summon in main phase 2. Huh. Ah, fuck. Well, that's disappointing. Hopefully he can't, um... Yeah, if he doesn't destroy a monster. Yep, that is a pity. But you, you never know. He might have been able to build something that I couldn't negate. And either way, if I had negated it once he built something... Oh, great. Yep, this may be over right here, folks. That's Reckless Greed. You want him early. Now he's doing Synchro Shenan. You know, I'll be back. We'll see what he makes. All that for a Stardust Dragon. And that'll put him at 55. If he can't summon anything else, I've got one more turn. And I'll have three cards. So just please do not summon anything else. I would I would highly appreciate that. That'd be fine and dandy like sour candy. Three thousand. Granted, with this here, I'm not gonna be able to make my big old uh fusion monster. So maybe this was a better better chance. I'm not gonna be able to blow that up with Meyer Mellow. Or Dark Hole. Hmm. Yep. Too combo-oriented. Damn Stardust Dragon. So we get our second loss. I'll see you in the third duel. Okay, third duel versus... GGWP. More of a 40-card deck. We're going first again. Which is suck sauce. 
go ahead and get our Lakari, even though we already have one. But he's slightly better than Darius. And you never want to start out with Torrential Tribute, but you never know. If you get something that I really can't deal with, that's probably the better way to deal with it. Yeah. I mean, we'll see what he has. It's fallen out of favor a little bit. Great, more Light Swarms. Eh. More Synchro Decks. Let's see, Lumina? Yeah, so if he gets, like, Michael, got Torrential Tribute. Or if he happens to get a Judgment Dragon first turn. Let's see what he summons. Uh, yeah, because he's going to blow stuff up, so I'm just going to Torrential Tribute that. Because he already used his normal summon. I don't think he can recover. Well, granted, that's what I thought last time. Maybe he's playing some sort of Chaos. Although, to be fair with that last duel, again... As I always point out, or well, I always like to point out, like, if you win with your one-of card, it's not really, like, it's not like your deck, like, he could have just as easily have milled that black luster. It's not a key component of his deck. Which, granted, I guess this is one of, but I also play, like, a Raigeki and two Dark Holes that do essentially the same thing. I'm just, it's just clearing the field. Eh, maybe I'd, eh, I'm already here. Ooh, Clearween Synchro Dargon. Luckily, I don't have very many monsters with, uh, oh, but I still have to target him. Fuck. Um, let's see. What can do? Not much. So once per turn, he could just negate it. Yeah, we're good for now. I could stall a turn and then make a level 4 thing that can get over that, maybe. Do I play Gem Knight Pearl? I do not. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, wait, but, uh, Gaga -ga -ga Gunman. Yeah, that won't target, and that'll be able to get over that. Oh, he's using Soul Charge. So he's not even attacking this turn. Granted, it's fucking some weird synchro bullshit, so... With Shiranui's and Zombies and Light Swarms, he's just got all these things. Well, I'll just go ahead and chain that, even though he can't attack anyway. But whatever. <laughs> Oh, so we made this on the turn that he can't attack. That doesn't seem like a very good prospect at all, really, when you think about it. Um, granted, I still can't target it for attacks. Or target it with effects. Damn clear wing synchro dragon. But I can get rid of this. Swap out. I can get another Lakari back if I get, uh, what's-his-name who lets me add stuff from my hand. So yeah, we got some plays. Millin', millin', millin' all day long. Um, let's see. Actually, I might have more plays. Wait, I could special summon that with Dar- okay, and then I'll have even more stuff. We'll get the infected male out here. We'll use it on Lakari for more extra damage. Because he's already down 4,000. So there's another almost 2,000. We'll get rid of Lilia. Main phase 2, we'll swap out. We'll get our... Um, no, the only ones I have are mine. Get out this... Oh, damn it! No, because I wanted to trade for Darius. Ah, fuck! I hate the world. Why do I not think these things through? Should have traded Darius first. 
Yeah, because Darius would special summon, then I could have a, uh, a rank 4 Ixy and a Gladiator Beast. It'd be the best of both worlds. Um, yeah, let's just... Well, let's, we'll get our guy back. Fuck. Why am I so dumb? Um, let's see. Oh, and I'm in main phase too, so Gunman's not even gonna work. Um... But he can't target this for attacks if I control the face up. And I can attack directly with stuff. Yeah, this may work. Let's try this. Ha ha! Can't target with me for attacks. Next turn I'll attack directly for 2,000. Attack directly for almost 2,000. Oh, you're getting a whole bunch of stuff, aren't you? I should have put this in defense mode. Then he wouldn't have been able to do... Well, he could still castell it. I still got Wabaku, so I've got a turn. So close. Attack directly over your monsters. Ah, Twin Twister. Is he just going to get rid of both of these? No, okay. Well, I'll Wabaku. Yay me. So if somehow he destroys this. But he made the mistake of leaving me with my face-up spell card, so you still can't target this for attacks. Now he's got that guy. Zombies can't be destroyed by battle for the rest of the turn. Yep, it's just all about what rank... I, I'm pretty sure he's just got freaking 101 and he'll take that, which I still got... Um... Wabaku for this turn, but I'm not going to be able to kill him next turn. Fuck. If only I wasn't so dumb. I'd have another monster out here. I hit Wabaku, you idiot! Ah. <laughs> Yay! Fuck you! Granted, I think it could resummon something. Cause I'm waiting. I forget what all these things do. Oh, that guy's got something. Target one of your banished zombie monsters, return it. Okay, so next turn he's going to make a big thing. Um, and I've got nothing in the way of defense. I've got very little in the way of defense. We'll just attack with that. Oh wait, no. I could do this now. Pretty sure. Darius? I should have checked the great. Either way, he has the second most attack. Yes! We'll just get out... This guy! Doesn't matter, the point is it's rank 4. And then... He still can't attack... Okay, so... What can he make? Rank 8. I won't be able to attack that if I get that out. Alternatively, I could... Giant hand, and that's the only thing that stuns, but it only has 2,000 attack. Okay, he surrendered. Well, either way. Oh, I could have ga 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 I could have gunman for game. Why didn't I think of that? I was too busy thinking about next turn. But either way, we get a, we get at least one win. There we go. Hopefully, we can uh, start a get a streak going uh, in the next duel. Okay, here we are, fourth duel versus Shin or Chin. Depending on where you're from, we finally get to go second. And we got a pretty decent opening hand. Um, we don't have our thing that allows us to attack directly, but he's got defense position. We've got our Tenki, which means we'll get Lacquery and we'll be able to attack, hopefully, over whatever he's got. Unless it's like a Raikou and we're doing more Light Swarms. Oh, and we've got our Proving Grounds. So, let's go ahead. Get our Beat Stick. Normal salmon. Bada bungo. Ooh. That's gonna be a tricky one. Um. Hmm. I'll trade out. I'll get my Darius. We'll add. What's his name? Bestiari. Yeah. Bestiari. Bestiari. 
Because that way, next turn, we can attack twice with him, then summon this guy, blow up two cards, and Bob's your uncle. We got effect negation. It's always good when you get your war chariot. Ooh, some kind of stick. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to continue with my theory that uh, we need to stop things as soon as they come out. Let's see how that works. Like, yeah, it didn't work in that one duel, but let's see. Let's try it for this whole theory. Yeah, see, it worked this time. Assuming that's not, uh, like, Mirror Force or something. Um, just in case, though... I'd rather get 3,200 on than nothing. Well, you know what? This isn't going to do much anyway. So we'll just get this back in the deck, hopefully. There we go. And then... Oh, summon out that. But... I have Wabaku. So I'm going to hit you for that 800, or I'm going to hit me for something. And then what we're going to do... Tag him out. Get ourselves a bestie. Pop that. Tag this guy out. Get ourselves Esquis, Equesti. Get our chariot back. Then we'll make Geyserus. Don't want you to have that. And we'll put our War Chariot back down. Your move, holy man. Your move. And granted, he could Dark Hole or just summon something bigger than this. Um, but if he uses an effect... Ah, Twin Twister. Brutal. He's playing rank 4 dot deck. Granted, he doesn't seem like... Yeah, he doesn't have a bunch of stuff in the graveyard that he can really use all that well. What do I... Okay. So, I'll just get Darius. I think that's pretty much game. There's not much you could do at this point. Because he's going to get that out. And then I'm just going to go ahead and get... Uh, my thing back. Thank you. And then this guy can trade out for two. Except for Bestiari, I believe. So, uh... I'll get Mermillo and my Beat Stick. And Mermillo will take care of that. More effect negation. Um... Could even... Just to be even more stunny, make a giant hand. Then that's two monster effects. Um, I don't really have anything else defensive. Although I could make this to protect from dark holes and stuff. Uh, yeah. So if he dark holes, we have this. And if he tries to, like, do something with monster effects, I got my war chariot and I can negate that. So he's not going to be able to 101 R101. Unless he's got, like, an MST or another twin twister and then he can summon something. I'll wait for him to discard. Yep, nope. Not gonna let that happen. War Chariot loop. Brutal. Too effective. There we go! That's more like what this deck does when it wins. GG, me. Um, we go into the next duel. Okay, halfway point versus Kablemu. Kablemu. Pretty nice. Um, I'm not sure if I mentioned my name or not. I, I had a whole bunch of stuff early on. Um, I'm actually getting into a thing, and instead of just outright telling you what the point of my name is, uh, I want people to guess if they can that this is the name of a character from what uh, fictional. Well, I guess all character. What fictional character am I named after? Comment in the comments. Um, yep. Like I said, unfortunately, we have very little defensive capabilities. I'm just going to go ahead and grab 
You know what, I'm just going to go ahead and grab another one of these, because there's no guarantee that he will be here, and I have nothing to attack. Oh, well, I guess I have Dark Hole. Either way. Either way, we're going against a, a not-so-good deck, it looks like. Three-card extra deck, big old deck. Um, I can't imagine what this would be good at. If it's an Exodia deck, it has way too many cards. If it's not an Exodia deck, it has way too... Oh, it's Kaiju's. Interesting. Kaiju Gradles. Damn Kaijudles. Who came up with that bullshit? Haha, <laughs> cause the And he didn't even run his eagle into the kaiju. He could have he could have had so much. He could have mm. Dark hole. Fuck you. Um Let's see. Yeah, I want this back in the deck. And I gotta believe if he has some kind of mirror force or something, he won't waste it on this 800. And then we'll just do the old California shuffle. I'm gonna put in defensive mode so he can't run uh, gradles into it. Yep, see, he didn't, he didn't use the magic cylinder because he didn't think it would be worth it. 60 card kaiju gradles. Too ineffective. Unless he just keeps getting... He keeps getting all the kaijus! What nonsense and poppycock is this? Now I need something to attack directly. That is not something I can use to attack directly. But if I normal summon it... Maybe he won't put another kaiju on my side of the field. Because he already has the big one. He's all good. He's like, I'll just run over your thing. And then I'm like, supplies. No damage. Yes, I will trade. Murmillo, fishman. Go, fishman! You're all blue with yellow eyes. Oh, and there's Raigeki. Uh, let's just to attack. To attack. 1900 tickle. Please, no mirror force. <sighs> What's he gonna do? Can summon a Gradle from his deck in attack position. Gradle Eagle. Do I want to continue the battle? No. No, I don't think that I do. Uh, Regeki. Fuck you. Oh wait, I could have just war charioted that when I killed it. Whoops. That's fine. I'll rectify that mistake this time. Ooh, draw muscle. Um. Yeah. Take that, Gradle. Not today, my friend. Not today. Ah, fuck. He could just keep doing that. He could keep doing it. Um. No. So, what I want to do is trade that out. Get the good old bestiari. Get rid of that. And we'll set our draw muscle. Because if I kill that with the effect, I could make whatchamacallit, but if I kill that with an effect, I'm fucking doomed. Because the monster effect, he'll just take it. We're probably going to kill this, yep. And unfortunately, I can't activate that when I attack, unlike Wabaku and the other things. Um... Killing that, yeah, yeah. Yeah. What I need to do... Okay. I need to get my trap back is what I need to do. So we'll wait for him to attack. Dram muscle. Oh, I got my trap. 
Okay, then. I'll do something else. No killing me today, please. He's gonna try again. Not destroyed by battle. Yes. Then I'll get... Meyer Mello. We'll get rid of this guy, because he has to be destroyed by traps or battle. Put out our Darius. Put down the War Chariot. Your go. Suicide of the Darius, I, you get the War Chariot. Kill this, and I don't care. Mystic Tomato. Interesting. What dark monster do you have that you can get? I'm curious. Oh, okay. He's just putting it out there. Oh, goody. That works That works for everything. So. Activate that on him. We'll attack that. Please, no mirror force. Yay. No, I can't allow that, I'm sorry. Attack directly. Scrap iron. But that's okay. The attack still happened, apparently. Even if it was negated. So, we'll get this guy to get our very important trap back. Oh, okay, so that's not okay. I was wrong, but that's fine. Let's just hope he doesn't get another kaiju. Damn grindy ass dick. Fuck! <laughs> but does he have a key? He does. Oh, This is so stupid. This is such a stupid deck. But that's the thing about these rogue decks. You don't have the stuff to, to stop them. Ah. <laughs> <sighs> Nonsense and bullshit. Next duel. Alright, here we are, six duel versus I. Or full Helm Knight. It's, you saw that, right? It just said I up there. Said I when I said okay. That's weird. Also, this doesn't even say waiting, it's just a gray box. I have a feeling something bad's about to happen. Uh-oh. <laughs> All right, here we are again. The six duel versus fucking around. You know, I don't know why you couldn't put that I in there. It had to be an N. We're looking at a forty-five card deck going first. Shit, <laughs> that's never good. We got Wabaku, so we can stop from being uh, uh, OTK'd. And we got Reckless Greed, so next turn we can get more monsters. No special summons. That's kind of sucky, but. Uh, Oh, he didn't attack. Okay. And let's... Yeah, we gotta get going fast. Come on, monsters! Damn it! We'll be back if I make a recovery. That's... You gotta... Uh... But fortunately with this deck, you gotta go kinda fast. You gotta get your monsters out. So that's why I play stuff like Reckless Greed and why I use it early. Oh, it's going to be one of those then, is it? But, uh, yeah. Unfortunately, I pretty much just doomed myself. I'm pretty sure this is, like, all mirror forces and stuff, too. Some kind of dang old stall deck with toll. <sighs> Nonsense. Granted, if I do get a monster, I can attack directly. So that's good. But I need to get rid of this. I don't think I'll have the time. I'll, I'll be back. I'm not going to make you sit through this fucking stall fest. Hey, we got Darius. Can I attack? Nope. I don't know why you're doing burn and stall. It should be one or the other. And I cannot... Okay. But at least I can negate effects and stuff. Uh, yeah, we're good with just the Wabaku, because he did not attacking. Let's try this again. Dimension Wall. 
fan fucking tastic. Wait, oh, I just take the damage too. It doesn't negate the attack. Okay, so that's not as bad. So, what we're gonna do... Um... I'm gonna bestiari, just cause I need to get rid of fucking this as soon as possible. And then next turn, we'll infected mail over all these defense mode monsters. Fucking mu diffusion wave mode motion cannon. Um. Yeah. Get that. We'll attack directly. We'll get our guy who can attack twice. Do maximum damage. Um, where are you at? There you are. That's a good one. Um, I still have the one. Yeah, so then I can... Yeah, I'll attack for 3200. And then I'll get out another uh, Bestiari and get rid of this Diffusion Wave Motion Cannon so he doesn't OTK me somehow with all these flip effects. Um, we'll see. I'll be back again. <laughs> Got him for 32. Swap him out. Bestiari again. Got all my support cards and none of my non-support cards. Get rid of this so he can't inflict 1,000 damage to me. Or 2,000 damage to me. Um, yeah, that's only battle damage. And if I can attack him directly next turn, I win. <laughs> ah, 13 turns. Okay, I've got two. I will... Yeah. Hopefully attack directly. Attack directly for game! Ah, fuck you. Uh, okay. Attack this. Hope it's... Ah, uh, what am I doing? Hope it's not Marshmallow. Um, oh yeah, we're... Oh yeah, we can negate effects. I forgot about that. No effects for you. Main phase two. We'll get out... Whatchamacallit. Oh, I know how to end this. What am I thinking of? Um, what am I thinking? <laughs> oh yeah, we gotta get Bestiari. Get rid of this if we need it. Oh, his attack was... Nah, uh, <laughs> uh. I was hoping we could trade him out, I'd get my gladiator thing back so I can negate more effects if I need to, and then make Gagaga -ga -ga Cowboy, and just 800 and then another 800. But if he can't put down another trap, I can attack directly for game. Penguin Soldier. Okay. Go for it. Oh, I already have another war war carry it. Okay. Oh, it's fine. I got I got Wabaku. I got a million Wabakus. I won't be taking any battle damage. Please don't set any cards. Okay. Whew. You know, that was a close one. But we got this. Glad I did not lose to such meandering garbage. Indeed. Good game. Even though I called your deck meandering garbage, you still put up a good fight. Next duel. <laughs> Alright, here we are. Seventh duel versus rigged. Let's hope the battle's not rigged, shall we? <laughs> I'm hilarious. Um, I'm sorry, that was probably really annoying. <laughs> I get in a thing sometimes. I'm in one of those moods, kind of uh, a little slap happy, waiting. Oh, oh, it's another one of these. I'm just getting nothing but trollsy decks today. So he's gonna draw a million cards. Um, we'll be back when he's done drawing a million cards. <laughs>
Well, there you go. He drew his entire deck. I got I got to sit there and watch it. So, he wins that one. I'm putting an asterisk. That doesn't count or it does count, but it gets an asterisk, damn it. Okay, eighth duel versus Irving Wolf. Interesting name. It's more like an actual legitimate name. Well, it's got some stuff. It's got that E at the end. Fancy. We're four and three right now, so we got to win these next three if we want to come out ahead. Hopefully we can at least tie. I would hate to have, um, like, I make this gladiator beast and the mirror force dragon grind ends up doing better than it. Granted, when you get stuff like Exodia, there's not really much you can do. This, hopefully, I'll have a little bit more of a chance. He's got some kind of a uh, destruction sword master. Good old Buster Blader. I'll show you what, Buster. I probably shouldn't be chewing gum right now. But it's just so delicious. Oh, interesting. Med Pendulum Magicians with Buster Bladers. Um. Okay. Cool. What do I want to do? I want to blow stuff up. I got to blow up all the things. I'm going to do maximum damage over the top of that thing. With our good old friend. Well, you know what? Let's use him while we can, because it's 400. We'll get him back into the deck where we need him. Yay. And then we'll go ahead. I think I want to get rid of this. Well, he's got other magicians. It, eh. Yeah, this I know what it is. Um, what do I... Yeah, we're good. Attack mode. Get rid of that. No more dragon pit magician for you, my friend. And he surrendered. Well, there's another victory for us. Uh, probably gonna put an asterisk next to that one, too, because people just surrender, they don't even do anything. Um, and we'll go into the ninth duel. Okay, here we are, ninth duel, all tied up, versus Zanchi, or Zanch. Hard to say, three card extra deck. I think we've played something like that earlier today already. Uh, what was that, great old Kaijudles? Good old Kaijudles? Of course, we got our affected mail and our dark hole, so we got a pretty solid start. Of course, we don't need our infected mail. Let's just give him the old 1900 attack point tickle. Hacha. Throw that out there. And just, of course, this into Bestiari, because he's got the one thing. Ooh. Ooh, interesting. He faded my battle. Um... Let's grab another... Well, I'm probably going to tag into Bestie. Because I got that Wabaku. So, let's just grab another one of these. For next time. Plus, we've still got a infected male we can use. Ooh. That's going to suck. Is he playing Monarchs? I could still Dark Hole and do stuff, or Infected Mail do stuff. Interesting. Moon Mirror Shield on Battle Fader. Won't that just be suicide? Oh no, it's plus a hundred. Okay. I see. I'm just going to Dark Hole then, because fuck you, that's why. Hacha! Trying to be cheeky with your moon mirror shit. Dark Bribe! <laughs> well then, you know, I could just do that, but uh... And yeah, I think I will. Of course we'll get that moon mirror shield back. Um... But we can, we can at least set him for 1900 first. And when he gets that Moon Mirror Shield, at least one, it won't be on Neospatian Grand Mole. 
Um, because that kind of sucks. We'll tag out. Do I have anything in the graveyard? I don't think I have anything in the graveyard. Um. Yeah, this guy will be able to attack for more damage. What do I have? Just a bunch of spells. Oh no, I got my Lakari. Okay. So I can go for a rank 4 play if I need to. Or I can go for a what's-his-name, who lets me discard stuff. Honest? With Moon Mirror Shield? No, it is forbidden. Ow. My most of me. That's alright, though. Hmm. Yeah, we'll just infected male. What do uh, I want my Lakari back? So what we're gonna do? Oh wait, no, I need to get rid of this. Um, yeah. Let's get my mellow. And he can keep paying 500 and decide if he wants to put that on top or bottom. Bottom of deck, okay. He didn't want to be stuck there. So now you're top decking, and I'm very much not top decking. So I think I have this one. Ooh, he's got a fire formation of his own. Wind up, rabbit. Interesting. I'm not even going to need infected mail for that. Aha! Uh -huh. Will he tag out, though, is the big deal. Because I've got a hundred more. Eat garbage, you garbage. Uh, yes, I will do more damage. Sure. That seems like a good proposition. And we'll get... Oh, I don't have any more, do I? That sucks. I know. We'll get this guy. This guy will let me get... Uh... Oh, where'd they go? Oh, well. Put him out there. Maybe I missed something. Or maybe I'm just not thinking correctly. Either way. I'm gonna break out, uh... This guy. He can't tag into stuff. But I'll be able to negate his effects. And I still got Raigeki. And it's just a big wall that he can't get over. Hmm... Nope, not gonna lie, you use spirits. We're just gonna be stuck with that 1500. Draw muscle A, well that's not as good. But he has to take this, if he tags out he loses. Which means once again he's uh, top decking. Let's go ahead and set this just to scare him. Even though I can't use it. Yay, bestiari. Um, attack for game. Waboku. I see, I see. I'll save bestiari for next turn, then. I've got to assume that you have some kind of a... Whatchamacallit? Battle Fader? Oh, okay, he just surrendered. There we go. We are officially tied. There's some asterisks on both sides of that, but that's fine. We're going into our last duel. Will we go, uh, will we just t lose it and tie it, or will we win it and win it? That was stupid.
Joe, cut all that out. Okay, last duel versus King Ka Kahaki. King Kaki. Something. King Kaki? I don't know. Comment in the comments. Got a pretty nice opening hand. We can grab any gladiator beast. We've already got Darius, who's our second highest attacker. We could draw a muscle, we could draw... Oh! But I need to be able to attack! Don't let me not attack. Fudge. Well, let's just get, um, well, let's get our Lakari, so when we can attack, we'll be ready. And I'm going to set Darius, and this, and that. I probably should have put him in attack mode, but I wanted to use Draw Muscle more than anything. Hopefully, if he gets uh, attacked, he'll flip face up, and I can use Draw Muscle before he's destroyed. I'm not exactly sure how that'll work. Um, breakdown of the battle step is one of those things I still have a little bit of trouble with, but we'll see. It depends if he attacks. Usually this is a big stally deck. If he's using Swords Revealing Light, I can't imagine he's going to be too intense. But, you know, I've been surprised before, a lot, so we'll see. Oh, Galaxy Wizard. So is this some kind of Neo Galaxy Eyes, Turbo Galaxy Eyes, Galaxy Eyes, Eyes, Galaxy, Dragon, something? Or is he just going to use that to get Galaxy Cyclone? Oh no, is he making fucking... Ooh. Cyber Dragon Infinity? Cyber Dragon Infinity is a little tough, but fortunately I have the War Chariot. So um, that'll put me at a distinct advantage because it's a quick play that negates effects. So I activate something, he doesn't... Uh, like, I activate something, he tries to negate it, I War Chariot to negate him. But it looks like he grabbed Photon Dragon, so I think we're set. Um, now, if I do that, there's, there's nothing I can... Yeah, we're gonna set that. Um, does he have 2,000 attack? He does. But I still have defensive tactics, so we're good. That way I'll be able to negate a monster if he puts one out. I got one more turn of swords. Ooh, Call of the Haunted. Photon Kaiser. Ooh, he's doing the actual Photon deck. Interesting. I like it, you're doing cool stuff, kid. Points for, from Hardleg. Make a deck that actually does things. Use cards people don't expect. Okay, so we attributed them for Galaxy Eyes Photon Dragon. Uh, once the card battles the monster, target the monster, banish it until the end of the battle phase. Okay. I think we're good though, because we can, we can negate that, and we can... Yes. Attack, my friend. Attack into my defensive tactics. Or is he going to banish? Um, go ahead? I don't know what your plan is, I mean, <laughs> you don't do the damage, you just tag out and come back. You only gain attack if it's an Ixie monster. Yeah, okay. Um, yeah, I mean, there's still the last turn of swords, finally, unless he could stall again. I mean, if he wants to use his effect, I'll, uh, I'll War Chariot it, and if not, I'll Defensive Tactics. So, see what he does. Ooh, using another Call of the Haunted, he's got that other Photon Kaiser. Can he make another Galaxy Eyes and then go into, like, Super Tachyon, Destruction, Omega Dragon? Unless, but there's very few things that can get over... Oh, yeah, there he is. Um, Attach one, negate the effects of all other face-up monsters. Also, their attack and defense becomes original. Ooh, okay. Um, once per turn, you can target two equipped cards, attach them to this card. You can attach one, target one face-up card, your opponent controls, destroy it. 
That would be kind of neat, except for it has nothing to stop it from being the war charioted. Cha-cha! Now will he surrender right here, after having made all that stuff, only to have it destroyed? No, he's going, he's got that Photon Thrasher. But if he controls no other monsters, it can't attack. Ooh, but he's got Galaxy Zero. So he could summon a Galaxy Monster. Maybe even this big one. Yep. Big old Galaxy Photon Dragon. Um, nope. I'm gonna wait for you to attack. And then I'll make... Oh, he's not gonna attack. Okay. Uh, no, we're good. Okay, now I can... Reckless Greed. Because everything he has is up on the field. We'll just... But unfortunately I didn't get my infected mail, which kind of sucks. But we'll do that. I'll get another Darius. We'll flip up this guy. And... We'll summon one of these. And then... Defensive tactics. <laughs> So, I'll just uh, ram everything into everything. Not not attacking that, you know. Hoping he doesn't have Mirror Force. Well, doesn't that just put sprinkles on my waffle? Well, how do you feel about Dark Hole? Yeah, that's right. Take that. So close. I should have waited until I attacked and then activated that. Because then he knew automatically what was... Granted, he would have activated it on the second attack or third attack. I'm not drawing anymore, but luckily I have these other guys. I still have my 1900 beat stick. See if we can give him what for. Come on, no second mirror force. Yes! And then we'll tag that out for good old bestie. He's the best around! Nothing's ever gonna keep him down. Okay. And another draw muscle. So now I got two of them. I can attack over that 800. Go ahead and trigger my effects. That'd be, I appreciate it. Realize I want this entire, de this entire duel, or this entire episode, I have not beatboxed once, and it's a pity because I am pretty decent at beatboxing. Oh, do you think I was gonna beatbox now? No. <laughs> I just, I just wanted to mention it, and then you'll never hear it ever. Sad state of affairs. I have stuff in the graveyard, right? I do. Good. Let's just go. Ha ha. And give them the old ho ho. Tagging out all the things. What we're gonna get? This guy. And just make sure that we're completely just un unable to... He's unable to do stuff. Um, and we can... Uh, yeah, we'll just get that. Because draw muscle. Gotta have something we can use draw muscle on. You know, it's got 22. It's, it's so much. But that's what we call a target... Or a uh, distraction. You look at that and you're like, Oh, I don't want that 2200 to be face up on the field. I attack that and then go right into my trap. Which is actually a quick play spell card. Okay. I guess I could just negate that and attack now. But he can't summon the other one. He doesn't have nothing to discard. And this has zero defense. You know. So... Not much you can do there. I'm going to call this now a good game. I'll come back if there's uh, anything changes. <clears throat> yeah, why even tag out even? I'll just ga 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 cowboy like some kind of bitch. Because I'm tired of this. This is done. We did good. I'll see you guys in the end screen. <clears throat> so, there we go. There's a Gladiator Beast beatbox deck. Did pretty well. It beat some things. It toolboxed some things. Not perfectly awesome, but... 
I mean, like I said, it, it's still relatively competitive. It's a good tier 3, tier 2 deck, um, especially with a little bit of work and against certain uh, matchups. It really comes alive more in the side deck. There are certain things where my body of a shield or forbidden lance can be really, really useful. Um, and I just didn't, I, it wasn't useful enough all the time because I play singles. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoy it. There is something I forgot to mention during the, uh, the duels that you need to know when you're playing this deck. Um, go to settings and this auto chain order. This is normally on. You want to check it off if you're playing this deck. Um, that lets you choose the order of chains when multiple things happen at the same time. So, the Gladiator Beast effect and the Infected Mail both happen at the same time. If you leave this checked, it'll the AI will automatically choose Infected Mail and send them to the graveyard before you can use your Gladiator Beast effects. So, um, you want to check that and then always make sure that you pick the second choice. Uh, it should say Special Summon. Sometimes it just says question marks. But it'll be the second choice, the one over on the uh, the right. So, there you go. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Next week, I'll be doing something new from Shining Victories, something that's been requested a lot. Uh, until then, good luck, have fun. <laughs>